So good morning, students. Uh, today we'll be discussing about endocrine system and plants. So first, I will explain to you all about uh, the endocrine system and plants, and after that, uh, we will have a, a discussion round or else a question round, I can say. So first of all, let me show you the glands okay, uh, of endocrine system. So uh, in the endocrine system, uh, so the first gland which you are having is uh, pineal gland, then pituitary gland, hypothalamus, thyroid, parathyroid, thymus, pancreas, adrenal glands, and testes uh, you will find in the uh, male, and for female you will find ovary. Understand? I uh, now I'm just naming the the glands. In the next slide, we will discuss about uh, the function of these glands one by one. Uh, where this located, where, where they are uh, situated, we will discuss about this in the next slide. So for now, uh, all these are the names. Understand? Uh, all the names are same for both male and female, except for the male we will get testes or testicles. And for female, you will be getting ovary. That is the only difference. Other than that, uh, all the glands are same. Understand, everyone? Yes? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay, so what do you mean by endocrine system? Endocrine system means uh, they are a network of glands. We have seen uh, in the previous slide that uh, many glands were there pineal glands, uh, hypothalamus, parathyroid, thyroid. So all these glands, what, uh, what do they do? Means they are like a network. Understand? Means they are like a network. They all uh, communicate. They all unite with each other. Means, And after that, what do they do? They make hormones. This endocrine system or endocrine glands, they make hormones. And these hormones, uh, what do they do? They help the cells. Okay, means uh, you have cells. It's not in your body. So, uh, they will help the cells to function or else to communicate to each other. Means uh, they will help each other. Understand? They will help each other. And uh, these glands, uh, this endocrine system, uh, all the glands, whatever you see, they are for all. They are for all means what? Uh, they are for cell, then organ, and also uh, function in your body. Whatever uh, function system is, every day, your day-to-day -day life is functioning. Yeah? This, uh, however it is functioning, all these are also because of the endocrine system. Understand? Means they communicate with each other, they help each other, so that they can make hormones, and uh, also help the cells, to communicate or else uh, to help to each other. Understand? And they also make, uh, they also help, or they also help in cell, then organ, then also, it also helps in uh, function of our body. Is it clear, everyone? About endocrine system, is it clear? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So, uh, what is gland? So, it's the same thing like uh, the endocrine system, uh, which I have discussed just now. So, gland is what? Uh, gland is an organ. Okay, gland is an organ uh, that that makes uh, that makes hormones. Okay, so that they will do uh, some work. And what will they do? This endocrine system. This endocrine system, uh, they will release. Okay, they will release all the hormones and they will go uh, into your bloodstream. Is it clear? Means they will go and supply. Means that. Is it clear, everyone? Is it clear? Okay.
Okay, next is this. So, uh, same thing which I have discussed in the previous uh, in the previous slide. The same thing only means these are the names of these are the names of the endocrine system. Okay, these are the name of the glands. Uh, first is hypothalamus, then pituitary, thyroid, parathyroids, then adrenals, penile bodies, ovaries, testes. So all these are the names. Is it clear? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So now uh, let's discuss about the function of the endocrine system. So what is the function? First, what do they do? They make hormones. Uh, this endocrine system, they make hormones uh, which controls your mood. Okay, whatever mood you are having, happy, sad, or else neutral, all these things are controlled by the endocrine system. And also they help in what? They also help in growth and development. Means uh, the way you grow, the way you develop your brain, the way you develop your skills, your physical activities which you can do, all these are uh, controlled. Okay, all these are controlled by the endocrine system. Next is metabolism. I mean how your body will function. So uh, this endocrine system helps you in that thing also. And also your organs, they are also responsible for what? For maintaining your organ system, all these organs and reproduction. How uh, means in reproductive system part, both for male and female also, they also have some, uh, this, this thing. Next is what? Controls on how the hormones are released means uh, the endocrine system will control like uh, how much amount of hormones uh, will be uh, sending, they will be sending to the different parts of your body. Okay, all these things, they will control them. They will control it. Next is what? Sends those hormones into your bloodstream so that they can travel to other body parts. So, um, another function is what? Another function of the endocrine system is that they will send. They will send all those hormones. Whatever hormones are passing, they will send all those hormones into your bloodstream so that they can go to the uh, the exact uh, organs where it is supposed to be. Is it okay, everyone? Are you clear? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so far are you clear, everyone, about all this? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So, what do you mean by endocrine system? Bandrelin? Can you say? Bandrelin, can you hear me? Bandrelin? Yes, ma'am. Okay, Bandrelin, can you please turn on your video and tell me what you mean by enterprise system? Can you please turn on your video? Can you please turn on your video bundling and tell me what do you mean by enterprise system? Okay. 
What happens I'm doing? Okay, uh, Caroline, can you hear me? Caroline? Caroline, can you hear me or not? Okay. Um, KV? KV, can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Okay, you can you please turn on your video? Can you please turn on your video and tell me what do you mean by endocrine system? Yes, ma'am. <clears throat> okay, can you please can you please turn on your video and tell me? Underground mm. system is the chemical. <clears throat> ma'am, is my video on? No, I can't see you. Ma'am, is it on now? Still like, oh yeah, yeah, I can see you now. Endocrine system is the uh, chemical messenger system. Okay, you just tell me what do they release? Yes. <coughs> what do they release? Uh, when my video is getting turned off by itself. <coughs> oh, it's okay then, you say that. <coughs> they release <coughs> hormones. Okay. And uh, they helps in what what I mean like what they helps in a uh, growth and development, it's not it, KV. Growth and development. Huh. Yes, ma'am. Growth and development and reproduction. It's not it, KV. Reproduction, they also help in uh, reproductive system, these hormones. I mean, endocrine system. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. <coughs> okay, please don't forget. Huh. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay. You can uh, you can mute okay. Okay, just wait for a few seconds. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Actually I'm taking class now. Can I come after ten minutes for that? Oh, okay, man. Okay, man. Okay, man. Okay, sorry for the interruption. Okay, next, uh, we will discuss about the gland, the different parts of the gland and their function. 
So uh, the first gland which you will be getting is hypothalamus. So this is the hypothalamus. Where it is situated, this hypothalamus, they are uh, located in the brain. Okay, they are located in the brain. And uh, this hypothalamus, they are also the part of the endocrine system. And what is the duty of the uh, hypothalamus? The duty, the, the main job or their main function is that they will ask, okay, they will ask the pituitary gland, which is just next to the hypothalamus. They will ask the pituitary gland to make uh, hormones, like uh, how much amount, okay, it means uh, they will ask the pituitary gland, like, when to start making hormones, when to stop making hormones. So they will, uh, I mean, they will tell them, they will ask the pituitary gland to do all those things. Means it, it means what they will control. They control the pituitary gland. Okay, can you see the screen, everyone? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay, is it clear about hypothalamus, everyone? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay, next is uh, pituitary gland. Then uh, next gland is pituitary gland. So, uh, it is also the part of your pituitary gland. Oh, sorry, it is the part of the endocrine system. So, same thing, this pituitary gland also, they are situated where? They are situated in the brain. And uh, let's discuss now about the function or the job of uh, pituitary gland. What do they do? They get information. Okay. Just wait a second. Okay. So uh, they use it uses information. Okay. From the uh, from the brain. Like. Uh, okay. So this pituitary gland, uh, they they control the other glands. And uh, what do they do? Uh, this pituitary gland, they make some important hormones, which is also a growth hormone. Okay, growth hormone, uh, which, what is the name of that hormone? Prolactin. Prolactin is the name of the hormone, which helps, which helps the breastfeeding mothers, means who are breastfeeding their babies, na? which helps them, uh, I mean, these hormones helps the breastfeeding mothers uh, to make milk, okay, so that they can feed their babies. This prolactin uh, hormones, they are responsible for that. And also they uh, release this pituitary gland, they also release another hormone. What is another name of the hormone? Luteinizing hormone. Okay, this luteinizing hormone. And this luteinizing hormone, what do they do? They manage uh, estrogen. Estrogen is the name of the hormone which you will find in um, uh, this one woman. And also they manage testosterone. Testosterone is also the name of the hormone which, uh, which you will find in the male, man. Understand? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so this I'll repeat again. This pituitary gland, they are situated in the brain, in your brain, and this pituitary gland, what do they do? Uh, they use, okay, means they, I mean, they are, they control the other glands in your body. What to do? I mean, at this time, what to do? At this time, what not to do? So they control this pituitary gland, they control the other glands in your body, and they also make uh, many hormones and among all those hormones, I, I will discuss with you about uh, growth hormone, which is released by, which are made by the pituitary gland. The name of the hormone is what? Prolactin. So this prolactin, what they helps in what? They helps the breastfeeding mothers. Okay, so that they can feed their babies, no? Milk. So this prolactin, they are, uh, it is the name of the hormone which are released by the pituitary gland. So with this prolactin hormones, uh, I mean, uh, milk is being produced from a woman to the, I mean, to the breastfeeding mothers. And next is what, a luteinizing hormone. Luteinizing hormone, uh, 
what is the function of this luteinizing hormone they manage estrogen understand means they control uh, estrogen which is found in women and testosterone which you will find in men so uh, that is the function of the pituitary gland is it clear about pituitary gland everyone yes ma'am next is uh, pineal gland okay so a pineal gland also same thing you will find in your brain and this pineal gland what do they do they make some chemical which is known as uh, melatonin so this melatonin what do they do uh, they helps your body okay to to go to sleep means it helps this pineal gland they are responsible for your sleep cycle so they help you in uh, sleeping i mean sleeping controlling your sleep or else sleep cycle this pineal gland uh, they manage it they release a chemical which is known as melatonin and they are responsible this melatonin they are responsible for what they are responsible for the sleep cycle it controls your sleep okay is it clear everyone hypothalamus pituitary and pineal gland which are found in the brain is it clear everyone yes ma'am okay. okay now kimtu can you hear me kimtu Pintu, can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Okay, can you please turn on your video and tell me uh, the function of pituitary gland? Function of pituitary gland? First, you tell me where is the pituitary gland situated or located, and afterwards, you tell me uh, their function. Yes, can you can you hear me? Okay, next, uh, Sakani, can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Okay, can you please turn on your video and tell me? Uh, about pituitary, uh, yeah, pituitary gland. Is my video on, ma'am? Yes, yes, I can see. Can you see me? Yes, yes. First, you tell uh, me uh, where is this pituitary gland situated? Uh, this uh, pituitary gland uh, is located in the brain. Okay. And they get information from the brain to control uh, all the glands. Okay. And they make they make many glands. Hmm. They make many hormones. Okay. Can you name and uh, they, uh, Emma? And they release the hormones. Uh, the hormones. Uh, prolactin. Okay. And uh, luteinizing. Luteinizing. Prolactin. Uh, prolactin. Who is? Uh, I mean, what is the benefit of prolactin? Um, they help the breastfeeding. Breastfeeding mothers. Breastfeeding mothers. Okay, so that uh, milk can be released. 
It's not that milk can be released so that they can feed their babies. It's not it. Yes, ma'am. Okay, anything else? And they manage the estrogen in the woman. Huh. And the test. Do you know? Testosterone. You see, you see. in the. Huh. Testosterone in the men. Okay. Okay. Good. Okay. I hope it's clear, everyone. I mean, the glands, whatever is being found in the brain. So next, uh, we will discuss about thyroid. Thyroid gland. So the thyroid gland, you will find in your neck portion. Okay, in your neck portion. In your neck portion, uh, you will be getting your thyroid gland. So uh, this thyroid gland, you will find at the front part. Okay, at the front part of your neck, you will find the uh, thyroid, that is anterior side. Anterior means front, don't forget that, anterior part. And this uh, thyroid gland, what do they do? They also make hormones and what is the function of that? They control your metabolism. Understand, your metabolism means your body, how will it work, how it will function. So they control your metabolism. It lies at the front part, that is the anterior part in your neck. Is it clear about thyroid gland? Ma'am, uh, repeat again. So this thyroid gland, they are located in your neck portion. Neck. Here. Okay. Gala. And uh, they are they are located where? And the front portion, that is the anterior side. And what is the function of this thyroid gland? The function is that they control metabolism. Understand, they control how your body uh, should work, all those things. Is it clear? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay, yes, next, is, next is uh, parathyroid. So parathyroid, where they are situated, same thing in your neck portion, but this parathyroid, they are uh, located at the back side, at the back side, that means the posterior side. Understand? And this thyroid, uh, parathyroid gland, you will find that uh, it consists of uh, four glands, that is one, two, three, four, four parts. Okay, four parts, one, two, three, four. And what is the function of this uh, parathyroid gland? Mama, I can huh? Mama, I can Mama. Hear properly. Mama, repeat again. Okay, so next is parathyroid. Understand? Parathyroid gland. Parathyroid gland, same thing. They are situated at the back of your neck. Back side, that means the posterior side. And you will find the parathyroid glands that uh, they are four sets. One, two, three, four. This yellow color. Can you see it? One, two, three, four. So you will see four glands in this parathyroid glands. And what is the function of this parathyroid gland? Their function is that um, they keep your bone healthy. They make your bone healthy. And uh, these glands, uh, they also control what? They also control the level of uh, calcium and phosphorus in your body. Is it clear? Is it clear, everyone? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay, is it clear now? I mean, uh, which the glands which you'll find in your neck portion, parathyroid and thyroid. Clear now, everyone? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay, Moi Chong, can you hear me? Moi Chong, Moi Chong form. Moi Chong. 
Ma fille Chicha, can you hear me? Ma fille Chicha? Nianou? Nianou, can you hear me? Praki? Praki? Rani? Yes, ma'am. Okay, Rani, can you please turn on your video? Kese dikre dikna hai? Ma'am, can you see me? Yes, yes, I can see you. So, Rani, can you tell me about thyroid and parathyroid both? Because it's not... It's not long. Thyroid, thyroid neck located in the neck portion. Okay. Front or front or back side? Front. Okay. Front is known as anterior or posterior? Anterior. Okay. What do they do? And it it controls the metabolism of our body. Okay. Next, parathyroid. Parathyroid. Thyroid. It is also located in our neck portion. Oh. And it has four parts. Okay. And big in the back side, ma'am. Back side is known as anterior or posterior? Posterior. Okay, what is the function? Its function post above post porous. Post porous. They control here. Porous. Means it helps your bone to be healthy, it's not it? Yes, ma'am. Bones healthy and also controls calcium and calcium and uh huh. Phosphorus. Phosphorus. Okay. Okay. Good. Okay. In the next class, uh, uh, we will continue from thymus, okay, thymus, pancreas, adrenal glands, testes, and ovary. Okay, so I hope for today, I think you all are clear about the topic. So in the next class, we will continue the other plans. Okay, students? Yes, okay, ma'am. Okay. Okay, then that's all for today.